Pancella Law Group, we provide business resources for international development, growth, and expansion, your bridge to the U.S. And while identifying your immigration pathway will help you navigate through what can be a very complex immigration landscape. Today's navigation tip is for F1s, especially those F1s that are changing status from F1 to H1B. Congratulations if your petition has been selected for the H1B cap. But here is something that you need to be very cautious about. If you travel during the pendency, that means while the USCIS is reviewing your petition, then you would have deemed to abandon your change of status application. What does that mean? Well, when, you, when the USCIS adjudicates or reviews your H-1B petition, it actually does two things. First, it reviews whether you're eligible for the H-1B, the merits of the petition. Second, because you're here in the United States in valid status, it allows you to change your status from F1 to H1B without having to go outside the United States visa process and return. That's a benefit. But if you travel during the pendency while the USCIS is reviewing your petition, then they will still review your petition for the merits and will, may even approve the petition. However, they will not grant your change of status. So you will have to stay outside the United States and visa process and return to the US 10 days before the H-1B start date. So um, these are some things that you need to think about and maneuver if you have to travel while, you're in, while the H-1B is pending. So if you have any questions, you know, email us at info at cellolaw.com. And for additional information, you can always check out our website, www.cellolaw.com. And stay tuned for more navigation tips from the Cello Law Group. Thank you and have a great day.